What is the best evidence for a young universe? Well, the best evidence is it's what the Bible teaches, of course. The Bible tells us God made everything in six days. In fact, most of the universe, most of the luminous objects were made on day four. They're actually a little bit younger than the earth, uh, by three days anyway, uh, because God made this, the sun, the moon, the stars also. The, the Hebrew word for star, kokob, would include planets and things like that, planets other than earth. And so the universe is young. It's thousands of years old, according to scripture. There's a lot of science that lines up with that, though. For example, the rate at which planetary magnetic fields decay is consistent with the biblical time scale. A friend of mine, Dr. Russ Humphreys, whose PhD is in physics, and he specializes in uh, things like magnetism, he actually has a model that is able to account for the current magnetic strength of the, the magnetic fields of any of the planets in the solar system, and it, and it works, and it's based on 6,000 years of decay. You plug in millions of years, you get the wrong answer. Why? Because the solar system's thousands of years old. Russ Humphreys was even able to predict the magnetic fields of Uranus and Neptune before they were measured by the Voyager spacecraft, and his predictions were right on. The secularists were way off because they were assuming those planets are 4.5 billion years old. They're not, they're much younger. The internal heat of the giant planets, Jupiter gives off more than twice as much energy as it receives from the sun, which means it's constantly losing energy. And it can do that for a few thousand years because it's a big planet. But if it were billions of years old, why isn't it an icicle by now? Why hasn't it run out of all that internal energy? The problem is even worse with Neptune, which gives off 2.6 to 2.7 times as much energy as it receives from the sun. Now, how could that be if it's really billions of years old? And I want to suggest it's not billions of years old. Spiral galaxies are another indication of the youth of the universe. You see, spiral galaxies rotate differentially, which means the inner portions rotate at one speed and the outer portions rotate at another speed in terms of their angular velocity, which means, if you think about that, that would mean the galaxy is constantly twisting itself tighter and tighter. Now, if you do that for even one billion years, it becomes twisted beyond recognition. And yet, secularists believe spiral galaxies are 10 billion years old, typically. But they can't be anywhere near that age or they would be twisted beyond recognition. But it's not a problem if they're a few thousand years old because they've twisted just a little bit since creation. Lots of stuff like this. The Bible certainly got it right when it talked about the age of the universe.